Hi, my name is Nathan Bishop. I go to Simon Kenton High School and I am a senior here. And I hope to be able to go into a field of computer science with a minor in business in college. And to help me prepare for that, I've been taking a bunch of AP classes here and um, dual credit uh, classes for NKU so that when I go into college, I'll actually have my first semester out of the way and hopefully my first uh, entire year so I can get right into my major and then hopefully go and get a job in the computer science field and see where that can take me. So uh, with going into computer science, I have been taking a uh, computer technology and application class and right now I'm in the advanced computer tech and application class and uh, through these classes I've been able to prepare by learning a lot about the different programs on um, the computer and how that can translate into actual career readiness things. Uh, for example, we just made a brochure and uh, payment letter for a company, I think it's out in Florence, that is trying, that has like a uh, wedding banquet sort of thing, so we're designing that for them. And then I've also done a bunch of certifications as well. I'm certified in the Microsoft Word expert field. I'm also cer certified in Microsoft Word itself and uh, PowerPoint, Publisher, Excel, and hopefully in OneNote soon as well. So like with the brochure I was talking about earlier that we were redesigning for the uh, wedding banquet company, uh, I made this in Publisher for it to demonstrate the menu that they have and some of the features that they offer. So uh, we put the logo over here and just uh, pretty much the entire menu through here with the different color change on there and some design elements going through here. And then this is what the second page looks like. They also have a pricing letter for the same company that uh, goes with the brochure we were working on. So kind of just to make things look better on it, the first thing I would do is change the font here at the top to kind of give the uh, name of the company a little bit more show off here at the top, make it look better. And then put a page border on it as well. So that adds a little bit of color to it and it looks a lot nicer. And then uh, each one of the menu options here that are on the pricing letter, kind of just change the color of those to match what the border looks like. So it looks a little bit better and it stands out more. And then also change the different bullets that are here on the side to sort of match the elegance uh, that the company has with it and make it look more formal. And then that kind of just gives the whole thing a nicer look to it and more color and more flair really. So another thing that we went through on Word is macros and one macro I made uh, to kind of help with setting up every document is one to set a header up which has my name and the date on it as well. And to do that I would just record the macro, give it a name, and then uh, put a place for it in the ribbon. So add that over here. And then just change the icon on it and give it a better display name. And for the macro, we would go into the header. And then put a date updating field. and then close out of the header and stop the recording on the macro. So then every time I press it, it just inserts the header for me and I'm good to go. So I plan on going to NKU. I actually got a full ride scholarship there because of my ACT score, which is a 34, and then my GPA, which is a 4.2 right now. So I'll be able to go there and take all the classes I want with everything paid for, like the room and board, the classes, and then I can have keys monies for the books. So uh, I have that going for me now and I'll be able to go through college and hopefully uh, fulfill all my aspirations with my goals for my job in computer science.